Hello Aquarius, this is your mid-July 2018 reading. Hoping you're going to have a good rest of the month. I know you had Mars going back and forth through your sign. Actually, I think it's going retrograde back into Capricorn for a little while. But I know it's causing you a little bit of strife in your life, maybe a little bit too much high energy. Some of you may not be able to control. Some of you probably like the energy. But this for Aquarius, mid-July 2018 reading. It will not resonate with all Aquarius. Aquarius, this is Aquarius, mid-July 2018. i got to get this straight. Mid-July 2018, Aquarius. I do shuffle these prior. I meditate. Always meditate on the sign. I ask my guides and some archangels. Some people don't know that, but I get, it's like a battleground almost, but I need some spiritual guidance a lot of times. So if you get angry at the readings, you're not getting angry with me. You're getting angry with what I'm calling upon. Beginning energy coming in. Seven of Pentacles. That is somebody who's thinking about a work situation or working on something that did not pan out the way they want to. And they feel like they failed in the situation, so they have to re- Evaluate the situation. Beginning energy. Past. Prince of Wands. It's a fire energy. Or someone taking on a fire energy. Could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It's in the past. They're in the upright. Let's find out what they're about. Prince of Wands. Why are you there? In the past for Aquarius. In July, mid-July 2018. Why are you there? In the past. Princess of, Cup, Princess of Wands, just tell me another fire sign. Turned around. Maybe it's two people. Maybe one was you thought was upright and they got turned around. Could be anything. It's people. To me, they are people when I read. You had a happily ever after situation or someone wanted it with you or you wanted it with them in the past. But someone kind of... That was back and forth. Maybe their moods switch off real quick. Or it could be, like I said, two different people. Obstacle. Obstacle for Aquarius. Obstacle for Aquarius. The high priestess. Maybe something came out. Maybe you feel your intuition is wrong. Maybe you feel like you're losing success somehow. I don't know. Let me get another card. Why is the High Priestess in reverse and the Success card in reverse as the obstacle? It's definitely an obstacle. Maybe I'm thinking your intuition is off in how to succeed, and you're kind of losing strength. You're losing energy. So maybe resources are a little slow. You don't know what to do with your life. You don't know how to go about what you want. It's not necessarily the worst thing that could happen to a person. But it's taking a lot of your energy and time. Current environment for Aquarius. Current environment for Aquarius. Strife. Strife. Five of Wands. Someone take a defense, defense, competition. It's a lot like the Seven of Wands. But this person, there's like equal battle. Where the Seven of Wands, someone's like got one up, but it's still a battle. But this is strife between more than one person. Current environment, mid, mid-July, Aquarius. Five of Wands. Why are you there for Aquarius? Current, event, current environment. Someone's off balance and maybe they're losing their temper and get a little, you know, snippy or you're in a bad mood or they could be in a bad mood. Someone's in a bad mood and they're, they're kind of snipping and, and then you may react and or vice versa. And that's why probably maybe you got these two, two cards, one on the upright and one turned around. It's kind of emotions are kind of all over the place. Let's see if the cards get it better. Uh, what's coming towards you? Oppression. I'm going to put these together because I don't know which one 
they both come out at the same time. So when it's coming towards you, someone may say something to you straightforward because they have a burden and want to take, get something off their chest. And it could be what they're thinking of you. could be the outside environment, friends, family, co-workers, what they're thinking of you that you're getting a little defensive and you're, you're oppressed or you're over too much stress. So let me get another card for this. I'm going to get another card for that current environment too, but that kind of popped out. Let's see. The oppression card. It's a Saturn card. Why are you there? Ten of Wands with the Ace of Swords. Could have to do with the Queen of Discs. Someone that's coming towards you. They may say something to you that may feel, may feel like a burden. They may take something off their chest. The Queen of Discs. It is the Queen of Discs. And that is uh, a dark sign. That could be Capricorn. It could be Virgo. It could be Taurus. Not in that exact order. But someone's going to, for some of you, someone may come towards you and want to take something off their chest. They're, they're feeling a little stress and, and they're, they got a burden. They may say something to you. Others, other Aquarius, people may thinking that you need to take something, you know, get, you know, leave those burdens behind, take them off your shoulders. You're carrying too much, carrying too much of a heavy load. Let me go back to this current environment because something occurred and it's not telling me a whole lot except for their strife there and it's leaving someone unbalanced. So, Aquarius, why do you have the Five of Wands as your current environment and the art card in reverse? Could be that somebody, okay, this is for some of you, not all of you. That someone may have indulged too much in, in the spirits. I'm talking about, you know, alcohol for some of you. And maybe you said some things you shouldn't have said and you let the, the you know, you let it talk for you. And people, you know, said what they had to say. And also for some of you that maybe you wanted to get together with somebody and they might have rejected the idea and it left you, you know, a little defensive and, and, and maybe a little bit of an unbalance occurred in your emotions. You got angry or they got angry that maybe um, you turned them down. But let's find out if there's a good outcome for mid-July. Is there a good outcome for mid-July for Aquarius? We know Aquarius needs to take a load off their shoulders. We know they feel kind of zapped. Outcome, Aquarius, mid-July 2018. Money may be short. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. That could be that. Maybe you're feeling the burden of, of having, you know, not enough money. Or maybe something's going to cost you. You may have enough money. It's just going to cost you more than you thought and that could be a situation between your partner and yourself maybe you know you had a disagreement over finances or what's your stability in general so ten of coin why are you in reverse for Aquarius I'm about ready to lose my voice <clears throat> I gotta cook in a minute make dinner I want to get this out ten of Pentacles why are you there for Aquarius could have a lot to do with the Knight of Cups. This is a, a water type energy. Could be someone um, that is a water sign, or just like I said, take it on that energy. It could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It also could be that someone's not offering you something. Knight of the Cups offers oftentimes when they're in the upright. So you might not have gotten this offer you wanted, and you're feeling the burden. Something's zapping your strength. We know we have an obstacle there over here. One more card for the wealth card in reverse with the Knight of Cups. You want something positive, something slightly positive. Maybe the overall energy will be better, but you're not completed something yet. You're still going. Let me get one more card. Then I want to find out the ending energy. Hopefully it's a positive one. 
need a, another card for this completion card. It's in reverse. It's not completed. It's like something's ongoing. It's not going to end in July. It may go into August. And you may be, money may be a little tight. Stability may be a little tight. And you may be a little burdened or a lot burdened. Yeah. You do go, you got the six of cups here. It's in reverse. Could have something dealings with someone in your past that had to do with money. We do have a Mercury and retrograde coming up, so that's going to cause a little bit of chaos, okay? Aquarius, We are you are not uh, immune to it because it's going to be opposite from your sign. It's going into Leo, so it's opposite your sign. So things may get a little haywire-ish, but the overall energy is the Ace of Cups, so you may get another offer in the end. I'm thinking it's going into August, though, to be honest with you, this Ace of Cups. You may actually go into something else, something better. Because this is not helping you out in, in, in mid-July. Whatever is deal you, dealings you're having or whatever, that Mercury retrograde possibly, it's just going a little haywire. And you just have to wait for better energy to come along around maybe August. So try not to let this be such a burden to you, okay? And I will get this out as soon as I can. I'll talk to you later. Bye.